ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पाक टेक यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट टू लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू मेक एन इवन पैरिटी जनरेटर इट्स ए थ्री बिट इवन पैरिटी जनरेटर बट फर्स्ट यू मस्ट नो दैट व्हाट एन इवन पैरिटी जनरेटर इज इट इज ए लॉजिकल सर्किट or which is based upon the logic gates and when on the input side if there is odd or if there are some odd number of ones we can say if there are odd number of ones on the input side of that circuit it will generate a one on the output side to make the whole thing even so let's start making our simulation first we need to go to our ttl that is transistor transistor logic ics and here we have our 74ls386n it is an ic for exclusive or gate or xor gate now we have two xor gates after it we need to go to our basic and then to switch and this is the third after we have taken the switches we need to take our power supply so go to sources and search for dc power and press okay in the last we need ground and some indicators or even one indicator is enough to show the output on the output side now we need to lower the voltage to 5 volt in order to make our circuit operation a bit safe because ttl are usually they are not tolerable of 12 volt okay now we need to combine all of these switches with each other on one side and then we have to combine them to the what's called is the supply that is 5 volt one more thing that when our switch is open it will be considered as zero on the other side of the switch like connected like this our switch is open s1 is open so we can say that zero is on this line which is going on this input which is going to the first xor gate this is second xor okay now this is the third input okay the output from the first xor must be feed it into the first input of the second xor gate and we will get our parity bit on this on the output of this logic second xor gate so we need to take our probe okay now now you can see that now all are zeros all the three switches are open and we are getting zero on every input like first input second input and the third input okay now we will press switch 1 we can see that our one is generated on the output side as a parity bit why it is so because we have 1 0 and 0 this switch number 1 is 1 because it is closed second is 0 and third is 0 so in order to make this count as e1 a parity bit is generated as 1 okay now if we use to press the second now 0 1 0 so again our parity bit is generated okay now we can see that two of them two of the switches are answered is 1 1 so number of ones are even if the number of one are even then there isn't any sort of parity bit on the output side so now now again we will make it odd now 
three of the ones are three of the we can say that three of the switches are on or closed. So we can say that we have odd number of ones on the input side, like one, one, and one. So our parity bit is generated in order to make the whole count as uh, even, like four uh, bits. Okay, like uh, the four, uh, we can say uh, we cannot say like four bits, but uh, it, at least it, it will generate one, uh, one as the parity bit. So hopefully you got the concept regarding the three bit even parity generator within the multisim. So don't forget to subscribe and thanks for visiting our channel.